So it is currently 1.20 in the morning, and we just got the 100 star drops in Brawl Stars. And so I'm going to open them on my main account, which has 28,000 trophies, I believe. Then I'm going to open it on my second account from high school that I haven't played on since high school that has about 1,700 trophies. And then we're going to play it on a brand new account that I just set up today and just got the 400 trophies for this very event. And we're going to see what rewards I get. So, as you can see here is the star drops. I'm going to do this just so I know uh, how to line up this footage with the face cam. So, yeah. So, our first star drop is a Angelo thing. Um, but, yeah, I'm really excited for this. Uh, I'm hoping to get enough coins and power points to level up Colette, maybe Spike and or Crow. I'm um, hoping it, maybe a hypercharge. Um... I definitely want some skins. Uh, I definitely want to get some bling. Um, other than that, I'm not really expecting much on this account. The other accounts, um, you know, obviously brawlers. That's really about it. Epic. Ooh, an epic. 200 coins. Legendary. Yes, a hyper charge, but it's sprout. I guess that's not awful. Epic. epic. A gene. Emoticon. Mythic. A gene. Epic. Epic. Piper emoticon. Epic. Epic again. I'll take 100 power points. Mythic. Mythic. 500 credits. Wow, I'm so glad 500 credits. Cool, my global fame's almost leveled up. Ooh, stew skin. Let's go. I haven't gotten the skin in a long time. Well, let's go. Epic. A Nani spray. Epic. Power points. Let's go. Epic again. Jesus. Byron emoticon. You know, the good thing is, though, I'm getting all these emoticons out of the way for future star drops. Mythic. Skin. I don't know if you can get a hypercharge. Skin. Or a really good star power. Or power points. I'll take it. 200 isn't a lot for Mythic, but I'll take it. Epic. Epic. 200 coins. Let's go. Epic again. Jesus. 200 coins. Epic again. <laughs> 200 coins. What? I feel like we're probably about halfway. Maybe even later. I'm a little worried this is just going to end abruptly. I am, I am, I do like that stew skin. It's not the craziest skin. Epic again. Um, but it's cool because I would never want to use my bling on a, on a stew skin anytime soon. So it's nice to get a stew skin for free. Epic. M spray. whoop de doo Boom. Super rare. Come on, go to epic. Go to mythic. Go to legendary. Epic. That's fine. Power points. Perfect. Rare. Bling. Rare. Okay. Well, we got Colette to power 11. Um, but like I said, that ended up abruptly. Luckily, we got two more accounts, at least one. Um, I'm pretty sure I should get it on the third account. I don't really see a, a reason why I shouldn't. I, I did get the offers in the shop for the one, three, and five free star drops. So, um, yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll open those and then I'll come back to my main account and do stuff off recording. So I'm opening the second account right now. Um, Chuck offer, obviously. Don't think we have anything else. Um, so 500 coins, 15, 110, um, 185 power points. I think Brock, Brock can get a gadget. Uh, Brock, Penny, and Frank can get gadgets. That's it. So we should just be getting skins and brawlers, theoretically, plus currency. I guess I claimed the other offers, but I, I, I don't remember um entirely oh yeah and i also forgot to mention that 
it didn't show the end recap like like the mega pig which is very disappointing uh not like i got much anyways but let's start opening on the second account let's see what we get i have very few brawlers as you saw i only had frank and bb um and bb was crazy because i had really bad luck on my main account when i first started playing and okay um, I had really bad luck on my first account, and it took me forever to get my first epic. And then I started a second account around, like, 10,000 trophies or more, and I got BB, like, super early. Epic. Power points. I'm surprised my main account didn't get more gadgets and... serious I have that skin on my main account because I bought the battle pass um but anyways I don't even remember what I was saying mythic 500 coins maybe brawl boxes were better epic oh BBC and that's actually kind of cool for having BB um I wish I would have gotten that on my main account but, you know, whatever. I'm just going to try and open these as fast as possible. Because um, we got a whole nother 100 to do after this. A barley skin? The gold one? I mean, that's alright. I have the the, uh, the wizard one, but whatever. That's just so weird how I'm getting that many skins. Mythic? A player icon! For a mythic? I don't think that's happened on my main account. A Shelly skin, which I got for free on my brand new account. I have that on my main account, too. It's a cool skin. Um, but to imagine that's what I got out of a legendary star drop is pretty sad. Now, this is probably going to end any second now. Um, this might have been more disappointing than the first one. But I don't know. Actually, no, I did get a lot of skins in this. Um, and I, I didn't know this, but I guess you can only get skins for the characters you have. I wouldn't know because I have all the characters on my main account. So... Obviously, three Barley skins, a Shelly skin, and a Nita skin. The odds of getting all those characters for skins, you know, and another bad Mythic. So I haven't gotten a single character on my casual second account, you know, like not someone who has a lot of stuff in the game, but isn't brand new. Come on. I got more Legendaries on this account than my... It's gotta suck being a new player in this game. Cool. Uh, I do have a ton of coins and a ton of power points now. Um, let's see. So we got a new Nita skin. We got a new Shelly skin. Um, we've got now three Barley skins. A lot of brawlers missing that's cool um you know three legendary drops couldn't even get an epic that's that makes sense i really don't know i don't know what else to say um i'm just gonna log into my third account and we'll see how little stuff i get so we are opening the third account and we have all this free stuff too uh 885 coins, 50 power points, 100 bling, 20 gems. These are the characters I have. If we don't get, if we don't get Cult, Bull, or Rosa, and at least one super rare, I'm gonna say that this is, I don't even know. This just, don't play if you're a new player. I mean, it's pretty. Uh, it's pretty easy to get new brawlers with the new Star Road thing. Uh, at least, like, very early on. 
Um, but uh, yeah, the game apparently loves to give uh, players who don't have all the brawlers skins, and then give players who have all the brawlers not skins. Um, so yeah, no one gets brawlers, apparently. My main account did get a hypercharge, which is very lucky. That's very good. Did I get anything else? I don't think I got a star power. I don't, I'm pretty sure I didn't. Uh, then we got a stew skin. But the fact that my second account couldn't get a single skin... Or... Are you kidding me? I mean, that's great. That's great to be level... Or to have 400 trophies and a hypercharge, but... Why would I need a hypercharge? I need characters. Mythic. Speaking of characters, I didn't get one. Also, isn't it kind of weird that you open? I've opened so many super rare star drops, and there hasn't been a super rare brawler pulled. Like, wouldn't you think that you have very good odds to pull them? How rare is it to get epic. even a rare brawler epic. from? Like, an epic star drop should almost guarantee me a rare brawler. It blows my mind how hard it is to get characters. I'm so glad I bought the battle passes when I did, because it was so easy to get the characters uh, when chromatics was still a thing. But now I know Nate. Nate's trying to get all the brawlers, and he can't. And obviously, it's impossible. I mean, I got a hypercharge before I got a character from star drops. In general. My main account's one doesn't count, otherwise I'd say two, but we, I mean, we got a hypercharge on a brand new account, and so far, um, almost 200 star drops, it's going to end with 200 star drops, and we probably won't have gotten a new brawler across two accounts. You know, my main account, obviously, it's going to get unlucky because of how, how decked out it is, so not only is there less stuff for me to get, um, but the game's like, oh, you play too much, you don't deserve this stuff, we're not gonna try and get you hooked, because you already are. Um, but, like, the, they're not even throwing me a bone on my new accounts. Well, this one they actually did with Hypercharge, but... And I... 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 A hundred bling from a Mythic. Uh, I don't even think I could take Jesse to, uh... To Power 11. I probably can't even take Jesse to Power 11. Probably not even Power 9. Um, and yet I still got her hypercharge. I mean, this account's missing so many characters. Can you just not get characters from Star Drops anymore? I am the drama. That's actually... Okay, well, we got a character. Um, I don't know why it kind of took me a second. I realized it was Angelo and not a skin. But I just don't feel satisfied. I mean, that was out of a Mythic Star Drop. So, yeah, that was still not awful how many legendary star drops i've gotten and i didn't get brawlers out of them but that's nice to know that uh 100 star drops got me one epic brawler legendary. two hyper charges 400 trophies epic. 28,000 trophies, one hypercharge. Legendary. Ooh, okay, so two brawlers now. Um, should have been a mythic. I mean, a legendary star drop. Obviously, you're more likely to get an epic. That, okay, now I'm not as mad. Uh, this is actually insanely lucky. Uh, it sucks that I got two hyperchargers when I'm never going to be able to use them and never will use them. The fact that we actually got two brawlers, that's not bad. I just would have thought a hundred star drops would have gone a lot further in terms of the characters. There we go. Three three brawlers now. Maybe four. Eh, that's fine. That was our last star drop was a mythic. Hmm. Let's see, so Jackie's a higher level. I was right, we can take her to power nine and that's it. I don't really like the idea that you can get hypercharges that early. I mean, I guess it's nice, but at the same time, like I had, so I had eight brawlers. I mean, if I had eight brawlers, I'd much rather get brawlers than hypercharges. I also find that weird that you can't get star powers and gadgets until you get them to a certain power level, but you don't have to get them to power 11 to get hypercharges. Now, obviously, that'd be absurd. And it, obviously, then you can manipulate it to get the ones you want. It just, it blows my mind. Um, my main account got nothing, which isn't that big of a deal. Uh, I knew I wasn't gonna get anything great. 
uh, especially with having all the brawlers. Like, at least I got a hyper charge. Like, I want to say it's bad. It wasn't horrible. Uh, main account got really... I didn't really get anything in terms of good, but in terms of amount, like... I got what I was hoping for, I will say. One hyper charge, one skin, and enough currency and credits to get Colette to power 11, which was very achievable. It should have been achieved. Then the second account, I mean, it sucks that we got three three barley skins a shelly skin a nita skin i need a battle pass skin not even a unique one um not even a single brawler on that account which which i'm still missing rares on uh or super rares mind you did i get a bb skin i did get a bb skin okay again this account would benefit so much more from brawlers than skins like the bb skin's great because that's theoretically the character i'd play the most because it's my rarest character um the barley skins were nice a shelly skin you know just whatever thrown in there the nita skin was a complete waste of a legendary drop uh they're decent skins and i believe me i love getting skins but why would i want them over brawlers the brand new account by far the luckiest two hypercharges three brawlers um we got a shelly skin a nita skin or no i got this skin for free from the shop but we did get a, a nita skin can we get a barley skin yes we got red wizard barley you can obviously draw your own thoughts from this uh personally i'm only satisfied with the brand new account because at the very least i if if this was my main account and i was brand new i mean i got hank and angelo i don't know when i would ever be allowed to unlock them because obviously you're stuck with all these guys first maybe here maybe this far if not then it'd be pam i mean these are very late 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 characters that you can get because of how new they are jesus christ this is what this looks like god well yeah i think this account is well satisfied uh skins hypercharges new characters this one was probably the only one that was good i hope this video is coherent obviously it's gonna take some decent editing and post i hope this video was educational i wouldn't say entertaining uh it might have been entertaining but this is the closest we'll get to uh, the pay to win brawl box days. And uh, yeah, uh, I guess if you're a brand, brand new player, you'll benefit from 100 star drops. But I wouldn't get your hopes up if you've actually played the game uh, outside of the minimal requirements to get rewards from the event. But yeah, uh, this was a video. That's about all I can say. I mean, I, I, I don't really know what else to say. Uh, the video will speak for itself.